Well, hello, boys and girls. It's when I feel like it o'clock. I'm Pearl of Wisdom, and you're listening to my NHL Pearls of Wisdom. Chance of light coming to you from the Seattle apartment basement. Um, so it's a good thing that we freshened up the uh, Pearl's house of spanking over the weekend. Uh, we went over there and did a little spring cleaning. And by we, I mean people that I pay to do it. Uh, I, I went over there and had myself some coffee and just made sure everything was going all right. And it, it was going going good, going good. I did that in between um, games that were awesome games. Uh, the Florida, Florida Lightning game and series looks like it's going to be amazing. Uh, Vegas outplayed Minnesota all the heck but couldn't pull it off. And uh, what was the other game? It was the Islanders, wasn't it? The Islanders? Let me go look at that. Yeah, Pittsburgh versus the Islanders. And uh, you can't win playoffs without goaltenders, boys and girls. You can't. And Pittsburgh just doesn't have it. Varlamov should be back tomorrow. I had Pittsburgh in seven, but... If I'm looking at Jari like that, the way Jari's been played that last game, now he could always turn things around, but I, I think I'm very, very wrong. I think the Islanders are going to win that series. But, all right, today I'm going to give you picks for the 17th, and uh, we're going to go uh, – also, we're going to look at the series after that, the two series that we have left that we haven't did. Um, so I'll give you a prediction of the series there. Um, also, I, I have to kind of keep this one short today. That could be good for all of you, I guess. I don't know. Uh, maybe you like the, like the uh, short videos. But uh, i got to keep it short today. i got to do some things. So let's get to it. Uh, we have. Are we going over yesterday's games? Oh, this was the thing here. Um, so far in the playoffs... I have not hit a side. I had the, I had Pittsburgh, the Islanders one. I had Vegas, Minnesota one. I had Florida, Tampa Bay one. And yesterday I had, or yeah, I had uh, the Bruins and or, or no, we got one yesterday, right? We got Washington. But I really thought the whole home teams were going to have the advantage here. Uh, being fans, having fans in the uh, stands and all of that. Uh, I really thought that they would have the advantage, but um, besides the Vegas game, I don't really feel too bad about that one because Vegas outshot Minnesota. They just came up against a hot goaltender. Uh, Florida, Tampa Bay, Florida played fantastic too, but I did mention yesterday it's hard for me to put money on Bobrovsky. And I know everybody's going to say, well, Bob Brodsky wasn't that bad, blah, 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 blah. Okay. The guy is not there when you need He's not stopping the shots that he doesn't have to make. And that is what makes a $10 million goaltender. For a $10 million goaltender has got to stop the, stop the, the shots often enough that are... Like you're not going to blame them for him for a goaltender for if they go in. That's not the point. You are supposed to be the best in the world. The best in the world goaltender or close to it, top five, top ten, stops a lot of shots that if they were to go in, you'd be like, yeah, you can't blame the goaltender for that. And that's what Bob Brovsky is not anymore. And that's the problem in Florida. And it creeped, it reared its ugly head again because they played their hearts out in that game. Now, was there a defensive issue? Sure, of course, whatever. I, I'm just saying the guy on the other side, Vasilevsky, you don't say that about him. You know, he stops a lot of shots that if they were to go in, you'd, be, you'd, you'd probably could say you don't blame the goaltender for that. But Great goaltenders stop a lot of those too. Anyways, let's get to um, Monday's games. Okay. 
Uh, we don't have, uh, can we refresh the odds here and see if we can get. Oh, okay. Yeah, here we go. Boston, Washington. I'm going back to Boston again. They can't lose back to back to Washington. Uh, Anderson will be in net for Washington, apparently. And he's not a bad goaltender, but if you got Rask compared to Anderson, I'm going to go, or sorry, not again. I had Washington. Why do I keep on thinking? This time I'm going to Boston. I'm going to take Boston. I'm going to continue going unders on this series. Unders, unders, unders. Uh, Boston's strong defensively. If they're going to win this, and I think they will, they're going to play super strong defensively. Anderson, actually, I'm more, uh, I'm more, I'm more comfortable for Washington to have Anderson than Voracek. Anderson's been there before. You just don't want him to be playing the next round. He tires out at his age. He's older now. He starts to tire out. He, when he's fresh, though, he's still a pretty darn good goaltender. So um, I'm going to go the under. I'm going to go Boston on the money line. You kind of got to go money line on pretty much all the playoff games now. Um, they're, they're all going to be so close. Uh, Nashville, Carolina. i am got to go to Carolina again at home. I'm uh, even though I didn't get it last yesterday, I lost on the home teams. Logic would say, and not everything goes to logic. Logic would say that the home team has got a serious advantage when they have fans in the stands and haven't had them for a long time. They should be feeding off that energy. And I think that uh, Carolina will do this. We'll take Carolina ML. Um, one thing I should have checked, I should check first though, is goaltending. Um, let's go look at the goaltending quick. And let's also make sure that the page is working cool. Okay. Starting goaltenders. I wonder if they're going to have those starting goaltenders available to us right now. Holy smokes. Oh, look at that. There's no scheduled games for today. What the heck? Um, yesterday. Sorry about this, everybody. Huh, no scheduled uh, game, so I don't know. That's weird. Um, anyways, the question is, are they going to go with Nedeljkovic or Morazic? And that's really, it's, it's really up in the air whether that'll be the case or not. So, um, if they're going with Nedeljkovic, I'm taking Carolina for sure. If they're going with Morazic, I may go. I may spread Nashville. I really don't like Morazic. Um, I think he's overrated. Uh, I think he's propped up by the team quite a bit. Nedeljkovic is the guy. you got to go with Nedeljkovic. I mean, he's going to be your number one forever anyways. You might as well. What are you going to say? Oh, he doesn't have any playoff experience. Well, if you don't play him this year, he won't have any playoff experience next year. So just freaking play him. You're the ones that went and rolled... Carolina is the ones that went and rolled with Morazic and Reimer for the year. So now you made your bed. Now you got to lie in it. Nedeljkovic is a better goaltender. You played Nedeljkovic. Yeah. <laughs> My little rant. Uh, so I take a money line. Pays 156. Not got to give up a lot of juice for that. Um, and as far as the over-under, again, if... Oh, they're going five here? Over under five? Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Over five. Sorrows. Jeez, I could see it being under five. I guess it is a good number. I could see it being both. 
I could see it being either really. So coin flip, you might as well take the ju give up take the take the best odds, the dog money and go two two five. Might as well. Plus money. Might as well go plus money and take the under. I think it's about if Morazic's in though, take the over. Uh Colorado St. Louis. Um Again, I'm going to go with the home team. I'm going to keep on going with the home team. I don't care if I got burnt with it yet to, uh, yesterday or today. I don't care if I got burnt with it. Um, I'm going to keep on going the home team in the first round, in this first game. I, I really can't understand why a team, the, the, the home team should win in this scenario about 80% of the time, all things being equal or if they're a better team. Colorado is a better team than St. Louis on paper. Grubauer should be in net. Bennington should be in net. Watch out for St. Louis this year, though. Um, I think they could push this to seven. They've got their heavy game going in St. Louis, and they could cause Colorado some problems. But I'm going to take Colorado in the first game. Uh, the problem is, is look what you look at the juice you're giving up, and I don't like them. See if you can get over to opening and at least get a 148. I don't like them in rag too much, but I also am not all that comfortable with St. Louis on the spread, which is probably your best value play you can get. Your best value play would be St. Louis at 180 to keep it within one goal. So let's do that. St. Louis plus one and a half at 180 is the best value play you got for sure. And the over. I, I think they're going to try to get their legs moving quick here. And uh, yeah, I'm going to go the over on this one. Okay. That's no nothing games today. That's going to have to be my full 42. I have to go, I have to go uh, um, give Helen a, a little bit. Uh, her, her, I've got a, she's an old lady. It's, she had to scrub the house of spanking today. And I got to, I got to go there tomorrow because I, I didn't, I was down money, down money for Sunday. So house of spanking for me. But uh, I got to kind of work little kinks out of her back and stuff like that. So she's able to make your pearls of wisdom necklaces tomorrow. She can't be all crippled up. Got to knit them all together. You get it by hitting the subscribe button. Hit that subscribe button. I'll send you a pearls of wisdom necklace to your door, pearlocoptered by Melissa and Hernandez. Until tomorrow, which you can, if you'd like to even chat more, you can head over to, uh, I've been wondering, did you even see what I was doing when I did that? I didn't, I got to remember to check that. Look at that. Did you even see what I was doing? Oh, no, that's right. We didn't have the goaltenders anyways. Um, yeah. Send, get, hit the subscribe button. We'll send you a Pearl's Wisdom necklace. I am crazy right now. Crazy. I got, oh, anyways, I got a lot to do. I'm going to let you go. You guys have a great day. Okay, bye.